Hey guys and welcome to the video and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, I have got a big confession to make and I'm a bit embarrassed to show you guys this. But I've uh, let the grass grow a bit too long and today, as it's glorious day for weather, I've got to get out in this garden and get this grass cut. So as you can see clearly guys, um, I've got a big task ahead of me to get rid of not only all of this grass on this side i've got to get rid of all of this grass here on this side as well so uh hopefully next time you see this garden i will have had all of this nicely strimmed down as you can see there i've uh, got all that layer of that grass down and i've also done this side as well so now it's time to uh get this uh cup and hopefully it'll look 10 times better than it does now I've now finished giving the grass a good mow. It's not the best of jobs, but you know, it's the second cut of the year. So not only I have now finished doing the back garden, I'm also going to be doing this patch of land out here as well. And as you can see, it's looking very, very, you know, tall and everything. Well, hello there, sir or madam. Are you supervising me? <laughs> oh geez guys just look at this all of it is now done and i've got to admit i'm absolutely dirty sweaty just look at this all of this here all of that all of that Ugh, it's all nasty so i'm gonna get myself indoors now have myself a nice bath sit down and relax and then i'm off to go and pick up yvonne from work because lucky enough she managed to get herself a taxi into work today so that gave me extra time to make sure these gardens are done by the time she gets home from work who the hell is yvonne talking to yvonne yeah who are you talking to Links. why are you talking to links <laughs> well, where is he now? Are you being naughty for mummy? What are you doing in mummy's bags? Okay, now that's cool. You know, a man should never go in a woman's bag, Lynx. That's wrong. What have I taught you? Hey, oh, we have a Techie Twos here as well. Hey guys, we have two of them here. <laughs> Hello. Anyways, I was just downstairs, guys, doing a bit of editing, and all of a sudden, I hear a commotion up here. I'm like, what is going on? And there's Yvonne shouting, get out the bags, get out the bags, and I'm like, what is going on? Like I've said in a previous vlog, um, I want to try and keep you guys updated. Oh, hello, Lynx. <laughs> I want to try and keep you guys updated with everything that's going on in my life, right? Um... The best way that you guys can stay updated on a daily basis is literally follow me on my social media. Because I upload different pictures of the wherever I am that day. I'll do little clips of videos. So it'd be great if you guys go and check out my social media and give me maybe a follow, like, and uh, definitely look forward to uh, seeing your comments and everything. It'd be fantastic. Adventure videos, as I said already, I want to keep up doing adventure videos. I've got a load on my PC that I just need to edit and get out on the channel so there will be adventure videos coming to the channel and I'm going to try and get one on the channel for Friday the 18th of June so please look out for that adventure I'm not too sure what I'm going to be uh, uploading for that day so uh, there's going to be a surprise for me as well so definitely look out for that video when it comes to the channel I moved into Rougely in May 2010 and Rougely Power Station was the first biggest thing I ever came across and I was like what is that? Then I found out what it was and I was like wow something that's happened this week in Rougely the Rougely power stations remaining four cooling towers were demolished I was doing a live video on my um, Facebook page but for some reason my signal dropped and I was literally so gobsmacked and upset so two of my fellow colleagues Danny and Phil has managed to capture the moment when the cooling towers fell down
and to be truthful honest it did make me feel a bit emotional and I did cry and and oh it's just really really overwhelming that sort of situation because you're not too sure how you should feel I tell you this now, the UK has been definitely spoilt with weather. It's been absolutely beautiful, sunny. The sky has been blue and oh, I couldn't wish for any better weather currently right now. It's absolutely so fantastic to be able to go out and meet up with uh, two local YouTubers today. I'm so excited. I have met Luke from Luke to Explore before. I've not yet met up with Ben from Chasing Spirits, so I'm quite looking forward to that. And uh, we're going to be uh, going to the church called, or the old grounds of the old chancel, and uh, doing some sort of like EVPs, recordings. To be truthfully honest, I am quite skeptical, but I also like to have an experience. See, the last time we came to this location, we were, we were actually leaving Rugeley. However, we are staying in Rugeley because we're only meeting up with uh, Luke from the uh, Rugeley Town Station here. And we are the only people on the uh, platforms, as you can see, nobody else is here. See, I have no clue why I find trains or railways or anything to do with that find it fascinating and I must admit I've questioned myself and I thought why is it I find it fascinating I have no clue but the only thing I could put it down to is maybe in another life I used to work on trains I used to be a train driver or, or I used to lay the track down or I used to you know I must have had something to do with trains unfortunately this is where I'm gonna have to love and leave you for this week I want to say thank you all well and truly for coming by and watching this video it means the world to me. But anyway, remember to do your best to stay positive and screw all those negatives. And I'll see you in the next one. Alright, bye bye. See, honestly guys, I told you I had a fascination with trains.